Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Just filming another cook with me video for you guys today. I'm using lots and lots of leftovers, so we'll see what I am able to come up with. So today we're going to be using a onion, a carrot, some leftover barbecue chicken from Woolworths. So you know those whole roast chooks, that's the leftover bits that I've been using. Some leftover thickened cream here. I've got probably a quarter left, which I'll use for the sauce. I've got some leftover pasta, some frozen peas here, and I'm going to be using a bit of the chopped garlic I got from Costco as well. So I'm going to start off with um, chopping the onions. So I'll fast track the next bit for you, and then I'll touch base with you once I move on to the next steps. Okay guys, so I've just got my water on the boil now, just to save time. I've chopped up my onion, I'm going to peel my carrot now, and then I'm going to chop it up as well into small diced pieces. I like my carrots really soft, so once I've boiled my pasta, in the last couple of minutes, I tend to add in my carrots, so it's easier for them to soften when I add all the other ingredients in. If you want your crunch, um, sorry, if you want your carrots still crunchy, then you can add it in at a later stage. But I'm someone that likes really soft carrots, so I added in a little bit earlier. Anyways, I'm gonna chop this carrot up and I'll fast track that for you. Guys, I'm just trying to soften up my onions now. Again, I'm not using oil, I'm just using a bit of water. And I kind of blanched the carrots in with the pasta in the last maybe minute or two. And I've just tossed it all in again to help it soften. So guys, I've added in my cream and a crazy amount of garlic because I love garlic. But I think most people probably won't add as much as I did in. <laughs> Um, so I'm just going to let this simmer for maybe another two to three minutes. Then I'll add in the peas and the chicken and the pasta. The chicken and the pasta is going to go in last because I already pre-cooked the pasta. And obviously the chicken's already cooked as well. I'll touch base with you to show you what the finished product looks like. Okay guys, I've just added in a bit of salt, some peas and the chicken. I'm going to stir that through for another 30 to 40 seconds, then I'm going to add the pasta in and then we're pretty much will be done. I'll show you the plating once I've finished everything. So this is what the finished product looks like guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed my video. Please hit the like button for me if you did and subscribe to my channel. That way you won't miss out on the notifications that YouTube will send you when I upload new videos. I post every Tuesday and Thursday. Some weeks I'll post bonus videos as well. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in my next video. This clip's just for those who want to see the plating. So there's the final product and hopefully you guys enjoyed it.